Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Hippie Reacts. We uh, like to mix it up on this channel. We like to do, you know, reactions to rock, old and new. And we use, I like to do interviews. And here is a Woodstock Festival 1969 interview with festival goers. And let's see how their experience was. And I'm from uh, Lynn Haven, Florida. I was a runaway. I'd run away from uh, Fort Benning, Georgia. As I was living on post there, and I had run away to Atlanta, Georgia. I'd been there for several months, and then caught a ride with Van and his friends, and waited a couple of uh, state lines, and then said, hey, boys. <laughs> I'm 16 and I'm a runaway. <laughs> My dad will kill whoever <laughs> whoever I'm with. <laughs> the driver he drove the van <laughs> I was the hitchhiker he looks like a van driver so, so you guys met on your way up here or? yeah well right well I, we, I picked her up with her and her friend Dottie on the strip in Atlanta and uh, actually another friend of mine Sissy Norwood told me that two of her friends wanted a ride and she wanted a ride too actually we went to pick up sissy and her mother threw herself down in front of the door <laughs> and cried and begged her not to come so sissy didn't come but we went up and picked up yeah. our two friends we got here two weeks before so uh, we were able to get jobs working for food for love and or i was and van he was part of security i kept all you people out <laughs> <laughs> yeah and i worked for food for love and uh had made a couple of posters and posted them saying uh free food stone the workers and tacked it up on my food for love so uh, stand but i needed to remember that i was not at the uh, hog farmers free kitchen and so Michael Lang happened to drive by while I had these tacked up. He jumped off his bike. He got jumped up on our stand and said, who did this? You know, and he said, he made some kind of comment, are you crazy or stupid? <laughs> and I said, well, I thought this was food for love. <laughs> 